Hi, I'm Captain Jeff Coates of Ducks, Dogs, and Decoys TV, and this is your D3 TV tip of the day. We're going to talk about hollowing out decoy bodies. You say, Jeff, that sounds like it's a lot of work, a lot of hassle. You know, sometimes it is, but my thought process is twofold. Number one, it does lighten up the decoys somewhat, which helps me out with uh, basically just handle, handling the birds day in and day out. And number two, more importantly, is we're not dealing with high-density tan cork from Wiley Cork anymore. It's all imported from Portugal. To be quite honest with you, very often it absorbs water. When you get done, a big bird like this, this brant, this has been hollowed out, there's going to be less, the less amount of cork in this bird to absorb water if, let's say, it gets shot during the season and, and it does start to take on water. Let's talk about how we do it. In the past, we have talked about hollowing cork, but I've always done it all by hand with a Fordham tool. And in the old decoy shack here, I went out and I've added a drill press. Drill press is very, very helpful in speeding up this process. Basically, what we're going to do real quick, we're just going to go and strike a line about three quarters of an inch all the way around the decoy body, the bottom. Something close to that. I've already preset my drill so I cannot go down. Actually, I was doing some bigger bodies the other day. So on this, thicker bodies. So on this, I'd like to kind of maximize, maximize my depth. Probably right about there is good for this. You always want to check that. You don't need to blow out through the back of it. And really all I'm doing when I, when I drill down through this, I'm just kind of thinking in terms of where the, body, where the body is. I want to leave a little bit of a shelf up front here so I can run my screw and washer up through the head. And I just really want to try to get the majority of the cork out with this drill press. And again, I'm still going to go back with the Fordham tool and clean it out just to clean it up a little bit before I coat the insides with the West systems. So let's get started. As you can see, the drill press with a Forzner bit speeds up this hollowing process greatly. Now, I still go back through with the Fordham tool, and I'll still clean up to try to fine-tune and tweak all the, uh, all the cleaning out that I can't quite get with the, with the square edge of the Forzner bit. Next step, West Systems and put a bottom board on them. I'm Captain Jeff Coates of Ducks, Dogs, and Decoys TV, and this is your D3 TV tip of the day.